guys, I know what you're thinking. What the heck is on your lips right now? Well, this is going to be my favorite lipstick, lip products. No, this is not one of my favorites. This is one of my least favorites. I just wanted to put it on so you guys would be like, oh my gosh, does she actually think that she looks good in that? No. I don't know why I bought this. I thought I needed a purple lipstick. Truth is, I don't ever need to wear this. So, this is not on the list. And, um... Oh no. Okay, just kidding. This one is Luster Ring. And it is a luster kind. I love the luster kind from MAC. But, um... Excuse how I look. Dang. Why did I come on camera? This one is, like, so pretty. It's, like, really pretty. And you can, like, swatch it on your hand right here. And it's just, like, a really bright pink. And I love this pink. It's just so fun. So fun to play with. And I love doing, like, uh... Neutralize and wearing this. Because it's just, like, freaking dandy. But it is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Another MAC lipstick that I love is also a luster, and it is Sweetie. And this one is more like a soft pink, and it's got see it's more like a wearable pretty pink and I love this one like usually I feel like I can't like apply over and over but this one's like a bluish pink I guess and I just love this when I want like a <gasps> OMG I friggin just bent it oh no, you guys. I'm a destructive person. Why? I'm such a destructive person. Oh, no, sweetie. Oh, no. Why? Why am I so rough? Oh, I'm so sad about it. I can't even show you the color. And with joy. I can't show it with joy because I'm sad now. Is This is a cream sheen. And it is really creamy. Peach Blossom. And I didn't even know I had this. Like, when I was looking for lipsticks, I was like, Peach Blossom? What the heck? But I found it. And I never even used it until today. And when I used it, I was like, wow, I love this color. So I had to put it in my favorites. And this is like a peachy, um, more natural color. And I love it. I love the way that it looks. And it probably won't look true to color on my lips because I just applied a million. It looks more pink on camera, but I it is so soft and so glisteny, like, is that a word? So soft and, like, buttery when you put it on. I love it. It's, like, I like natural stuff that kind of just enhances or adds, like, a little glam to you, to your lips. It's Sea Sheer. This is another luster, and this is, like, a wearable red to me, and it's kind of like an orange red, which I read is good for my skin tone, and it's not too much... See, it's kind of orange red, but it doesn't look this orange in person, I swear to you. And I'm going to be so gentle now. Isn't that super wearable? It's so soft. This is a luster, I said that already. But I love this one. Excuse my acne, but uh, I just love this red color so much. Like, I don't feel like too bold or overpowering with it. It's such a wearable red and it's so soft. Is a luster. I love luster. Um, Viva Glam 4. And I have Viva Glam 5. No, I didn't mean to put you on the list. This is Viva Glam. This is like a, uh, pinky natural brown color. And see, this is more of a darker brown color, but... I do like it. I do. I really do. Syrup by MAC. And it's a luster. And it looks like this. It's like a purpley mauve color. And I just feel like this is such a natural color for my lips. Like, it's like the same color as my lips, but it makes them look better than they do. I mean, you can't really see it good on here. I need better lighting, but it's getting dark outside. So, this is syrup. 
if you guys follow me on Twitter, you knew that I had lost this lipstick and I was sad, sad, sad. It was laying in my driveway for like a week. These two. One is a matte and one is a... Cream. Oh, I didn't swatch them! <sighs> okay. So this is the matte one and this is Mauve It Over. You probably all know about it. It's kind of like syrup, but it's matte and it's a lot more brown you see. And this one kind of matches my lips too. See? This is like perfect match. You can't even tell I have it on my bottom lip, can you? No, you can't. It just, I guess, makes my lip color more even because it is kind of like my lip color, but I like the way that it makes it more even and pretty looking and just enhances it. And usually I don't like matte lipsticks, but I love this one. And it's really soft. So this is like a really natural lipstick for me. Oh, look at that shiny forehead. Get out of here. The last one from Revlon was recommended by Style Expert XO. Finally getting her name right. And it is like a blue pink, bluish pink to me. And I feel like this color can go with a lot of things. I also feel like it washes me out a little bit because it is so pink. But I still like it a lot. Like It's kind of like Sweetie but a lot more pink, like a Barbie kind of pink. And I like this color a lot. But I usually combine it with another one because I think I look too washed out if I wear it alone. But this color is so soft on your lips. These cream Revlon lipsticks are so soft. So, I like this one, but I kind of feel weird wearing it like I feel like with my skin tone, it looks too bright. I don't know. So I always tone it down with something else over it. And it is like a berry color. Oh, what did I do to you? I'm a murderer. I cannot be responsible. This is in the shade Cream Blush, probably, maybe. And this is, um... This is a, like, berry red color. And I like reds that are deep and wearable. And this one is wearable, I think. It makes your lips... Oh my gosh, I have to be so gentle because I'm crazy. <gasps> no! No! This is a disaster video. This is not a favorites video. OMG! I cannot be a good care of my lipsticks. Oh, this breaks my heart, really. It really does. This... No. Oh, I don't even know what to do with this. I want to use it. I gotta use it a little bit. <laughs> I got to. I can't waste. Y'all. Uh, it's gonna have to mush back together. It's gonna kind of be like pottery. I'm gonna just spin it back together. Spin and mush back together. Um. I think it's a deeper red that's more wearable. Mmm, and it's so soft. This is like the softest color out of all of them. This brand is e.l.f. This is called Nicely Nude. It's just one of those pink colors that I can just throw on real quick and know that it's nice. And this one's really soft, too. And it looks kind of like primrose but it's more peachy and darker like woohoo look they all look kind of similar it feels like you're not wearing anything and it's like so natural you guys this one this is in the shade sunset angora and I love it because it's so it looks like nicely nude, kind of. It's just a brighter version of it. And this feels like you're wearing nothing. Gosh, I'm so repetitive. Like, all my lip colors look the same on this camera. But, it feels like you're wearing nothing. It's so smooth. Such a pretty color. It's kind of coral, and I love that. I love it. I love this color so much. I want to get, like, every color of these. Because these are good. These are good, good. The pigmentation's good. They don't feel like you're wearing anything. They last a long time. These are really awesome and they look so fancy. It is a Mary Kay liquid lip color. This is in the shade Sherbert and this is another coral color. 
I wear this one a lot. It's kind of like a lip gloss, but it like dries and stays on all day. This kind of is, uh, what is the, what is the name? Kind of similar to Sunset Angora, except this one gets a lot brighter. So you can see like this, um, gradient that I go from. So this one is good. I love coral, you guys. Mm, 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 mm. So, what does this feel like? After it dries, it doesn't feel like you're wearing anything. And it's so pretty. I love, I can't even, I can't even, I gotta say the same thing about all of them because I love them that much. Like, they all are awesome to me. They all look kind of similar. I didn't get to swatch my, my berry color because it broke because these are so quick and cheap and cute to wear when you just want like a natural quick tint and to moisturize your lips. So I have the purple, the blue, and the orange, which is what I call them. But really the purple is like, I think, peach. And I use this one the most because it's the most natural, obviously. And it smells the best. Mm. So this is like just a natural shine that I love. I love it. This is also another wearable red that I like. I like this color because it's like a pinky red. I just love it. I can't talk about it because I am a repetitive person and I'm going to say the same things. It looks natural. It feels soft. I mean, I don't know what else to say about it. I just like it. I do. Which is actually purple grape. And I love this one because... It's like a subtle tint to make your lips darker and more dramatic. Ooh, I'm like smoking a cigarette. But, uh, it's not too much. But it does darken them. See? This is the kind of purple that I can handle. Because I just love this one. Mm -hmm. It looks so natural. Stop that. But yes, it does look good. I love this one. So, at the conclusion of this video, I have realized that I have way too many favorite lipsticks. Like, I should have what, like five and I have like 47? I use the word 47 for everything. I'll be like, you've been in that bathroom for 47 years. I've been at this red light for 47 years. You ate like 47 pieces of pizza. Anyway, I'm sorry that I rambled on forever. I'm sorry that I acted psycho. I'm just in rare form today, and I feel nice about life. I'm so dumb. I'll see you guys in the next video. Let me know if you have any of these lipsticks, if they are your favorite, or try out these and let me know if you like them. So, I will see you guys in the next video. What if our life was a musical?